Welcome home, my apostles of awful. Alright, welcome back, you guys. We are playing Shadow and Mordor. Something just exploded off in the distance. Well, would you look at this? It is one dreary, rainy, crappy day out. And you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna kill the poet. Because we're jerks, alright? No, I take that back. We're not jerks. Lorm the poet is a jerk. And we are killing him because he's a jerk. Alright? The most jerky of jerks, alright? Now I'm gonna do what what Charles Dickens did in the Christmas Carol, emphasize to you that he is indeed a jerk. Okay, like, much like he did with Marley. Yeah, I, I figured it's uh, most appropriate in consideration of the fact that it is. Well, let's see, it's the 11th right now, 14 days from Christmas. You know, because obviously you're supposed to make a huge deal out of it way before it happens, because that's the way you're supposed to do it now in America, I guess. I don't think they do that everywhere, but in America they start so like after Halloween people are lighting out the well not lighting out but freaking pulling out the Christmas decorations we don't pull it out until like, I don't know, like a week before I mean we still haven't put our Christmas decorations up I mean like we we I mean we, she already well my mom had already done most of the Christmas shopping and stuff so I mean like you know yeah ah yeah I, I know you guys want to see me get in a fight with this guy but just because of the sheer amount of them that there is, and that the fact that they won't stop, like, they won't stop, trust me, uh, I'm not going to do that. Like, that because somebody sounded the alarm, they're going to keep coming, just saying. So, I know, guys, it, it sucks, but once we get stronger and we can fight off hundreds of people at once, maybe, but for the time being, with my health so crappily low, we'll have to wait. Alright, so it's a duel right now. So what I'm gonna do is whichever one's weaker, I basically gotta decide by which traits that they have, which is weaker, and then kill the stronger one basically, so that the weaker ones are all that are left. It's like reverse natural selection. Kill the strongest so the weaker survives, so the, the rest of them are easy. Okay, so let's see here. Let's go to Sauron's army. Yeah, I know. Uh, okay, so this is Lorm the Poet against Dugza. Uh, we know anything about him. No, we don't. But, it's safe to assume that he is probably stronger than Lorm, because Lorm can be killed with an arrow. Now, that's not to say that they can't evolve new little traits and whatnot, but he's also got three less power points up here in the corner. I'll let you look at that real quick. It says power right there. Yeah, he's got 10. So, Lorm the Poet would probably be the better option. But also, this guy might be harder to beat in the long run. You gotta think about that. So, I guess we'll kill Lorm the Poet because he's got stronger and we know what traits he has. Unfortunately, I mean, I mean, like, it was easy, but that's not what I was afraid of. What I'm afraid of is the other guy being stronger because see when you kill one the other one succeeds now if we're lucky we might be able to just do like a uh, well maybe we'll be able to do the same thing to him no see that's the problem though is he might have just gotten a new little ability thing to be invulnerable to that so you gotta worry about that is like if you kill one the other one might end up being stronger than the one you just killed which is why you take a gamble when you kill him randomly like that. I know, I probably should have gone down there and fought him, but then they would have sounded the alarm in a hole. Yeah, all kinds of crap that you don't want to happen would have happened. So, unfortunately, we couldn't do that. Well, we could, but we would we would die. And it, it I, I would prefer not to die just because it makes a YouTuber look bad. Either way, let's go do this mission that I said we, we, we weren't going to do soon because it's hard. Um... So, yeah, you guys might see me die, so hypocritical I am. Which is exactly why I'm doing this, to prove to you guys I'm not a hypocrite. It, see, it, it looks bad. It looks bad. That's why I'm doing this, because you guys will get to see, unlike most YouTubers where they do edits and crap, no, you guys get to see the worst of me. No, you don't actually get to see the worst of me, but you get to see the worst part of me. Worst parts of me. There you go. Yeah. Unlike most YouTubers, where you only see the funny parts. No, nope, you guys get to see everything. Even the parts where I die. 
I mean, most YouTubers leave in like a part where they die, and then cut out all the parts where they died like a dozen times. Now you guys get to see all that. And no, you don't want to see it, but I'll tell you what, you guys actually get to see what the game is about. Because I like to think I'm pretty decent at this game. The War Chief. Uh, Mog, the other twin. He's only power 12, though. Sometimes the War Chiefs will be power 20 and crap, and they're insane to beat. We don't know anything about him, though. So, we'll see. Look at good old Italian. He just punches him and he dies. Did you stay there? Uh, could you get me down? Why was he on the ground? Uh, I'm all right. That didn't hurt at all. He has bones on him. He'll be fine. Know what you're thinking, Ranger? This was not my fault. I go to tell a chief that I've killed his bodyguard. He turns around, got the exact same face as the dead maggot I just killed. We just killed. We just killed, we just killed you, sir. What are the odds of? Just make sure you show up to take the place of the dead war chief. Uh, but the war chief's not dead. I'm going to go kill him. Oh, good plan. Uh, I'll be right behind you. Now shut up. It works. Yeah. Knives work. Who would have thought, right? That's craziness. But we'll see how the war chief soldiers do in the face of a true foe. Rattle a cage and bring out the beast. And I'm assuming I'm the beast in this particular situation here because granted I'm probably the best fighter there is here. Yeah. Berserkers. Now you guys get to meet the worst of the worst. These guys, you have to do reversals on them or else they don't die. Or or they'll reverse your attacks on them. See what I'm saying? You can't attack them. You have to wait for them to do it and then do a... Uh... See what I'm saying? Basically, that goes on forever unless you kill one of them. But if there's like 20 of them, dude, you're, you're done. Yeah. Let's see, this goes on. See, that's so annoying. Oh. Okay, kill all these other guys. Dang it, I didn't want to kill him. I wanted to kill the Berserker. Alright. Nope, come on. I wish you would regain health a little bit quicker than this. I understand that that's what leveling up is for. Ugh. Mess up my kill streak, why don't you? Dang it! I hit the wrong button. I've always been bad at that, though. Reason, you died. Figures! Alright, see ya. Said you guys would get to see me die on this fateful day. See, it's so misleading when you see that. You're like, oh, I'm 100 feet away. Well, we ran for like six seconds and we're there already. So, do we need to get up there? Yes, we do. I do not think I have the death from below perk. We need to kill the berserkers, preferably this time. Oh, crap. All right, well that sucks. Get out of here! All right, we may have just lost this because that guy's getting to the beacon. Holy crap, man! Get out! Get! Yeah, here. Yeah, I'm gonna just let this guy kill me here. Or maybe, just maybe, we'll fight him off and kill him. Now. Screw all of you guys, I hate you. Whoops. 
Okay, recharge, come on. Come on. My my controller's like purple right now. Alright, here. See, every time you do a little bit... Oh, okay, bonus objective, kill him with a ledge kill. But do I have that ability yet? Notice, as I play this game, I get less and less patient. Come on, keep going. The climbing is good, it's just like sometimes it just like stops. It's weird. Come on. If you just keep doing that, they'll get all suspicious. Maybe. Stealth kill! Stab him in the. F oh, okay, that was in the face, that was my like, throat here. Alright, come on, buddy. Wait, he sees me? Ah, oh, crap. Oh, no. There we go. Whoa! Mog the twin has arrived. Mog! 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 The pain Mog. of my twin shall echo within you. Yeah, now we'll get to beat this guy by the end of the episode here, but we'll we'll do our darndest, won't we? Come on. Now that the berserkers are gone, now I'm not that worried. I just can't see anything right now. That's the problem. Yeah, I like literally cannot see anything that's happening. And my thumb is starting to hurt. Oh no. No. Nope. This is just going. It's going to be the whole time, isn't it? There we go. Did an execution on him. The executions are good. If you guys can tell what's going on here, congratulations, because I can't. There we go, do another execution there. Just keep saving those up. Next execution we get an opportunity to have here. Ah, crap. Nope, jump down, jump down. Ah. There we go. Did I break his shield too? A little bit. All right, jump down. All right, now that's better. Come on, get rid of that guy. And one more. No? All right. Ugh, how much time we got here? Not much. And I need to kill him quickly here, so everybody else will leave. Come on, get out. All right. The there we go. Over dark. Dark. Oh. Far from over? No, it's pretty close to being over. Now everybody else should leave, I'm pretty sure. Dang, I got tendonitis now, though. Holy crap. And now Ratbag takes his place. We got just enough time to watch this cutscene, and then we're going to have to end it here, you guys. <laughs> Probably won't put an outro in this just because it was pretty action-packed here. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was a pretty good episode. Ranger, we did it! <laughs> no honor our arrangement. Oh, don't you worry. War Chief Ratbag will make sure nobody gets in the way of your dirty schemes. Uh, but Ratbag can't speak for the other War Chiefs. I wouldn't worry about them. Yeah. Could I borrow you? Uh, I need a sharper blade. He's trying to cut his ear off. Anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. As I already said, if you have anything to suggest, you put that down in the comments below. I uh, hope you like the new intro. I'm going to maybe start doing that from now on. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. Remember, the most important thing you can do for me is subscribe. It puts the views on my channel, up, and it puts the warmth in my heart. i see you guys next time. Uh, and a, a Merry Christmas to be. i see you guys in two weeks for the Christmas special. See you guys next time, and goodbye.